Welcome future tea breads. This is Mrs. Weimer, the school counselor at South Aiken High School, wanting to say hello and welcome all of you to high school. We are so excited to have you on our campus and we cannot wait to get to meet you in person. And in order to do that, and in order to have you start attending classes here at South Aiken, we need to talk about your courses and your elective courses that you're gonna select for next year. This is exciting stuff. So let's get started by saying that you are going to actually enter your course request online through your PowerSchool student portal. So I wanna encourage all of you to check us out on the South Aiken High School website and or you can go to the Aiken County Public School District website, either one. Uh, but I encourage you to visit South Aiken's website so you can get familiar with it. Everyone knows that to get to your PowerSchool portal, you go online and click the A plus button from either the South Aiken page or the district website. From there, you'll be taken directly to the sign in page. And it will look just like this. So student and parent sign in. There you'll enter your credentials and go ahead and get signed in. Once you're in there, you will actually see a page. You'll actually see your current grades. And from there on the left hand side, we want you to go to class registration. You are going to Click on the button that says class registration. Once there, you'll see this page where it says welcome to South Aiken High School class registration system for the 2021-2022 school year. You're going to begin your course registration by clicking on the pencil sign. So do not get nervous by the exclamation point. It just means that this is a required selection so if everyone can click on the pencil it is going to bring up two choices you either have ap human geography to select from or our world geography cp which stands for college prep class obviously ap stands for advanced placement which means that it is a college level course so make sure that you are ready and prepared to take a very rigorous class there is a lot of homework there's a lot of studying there's a lot of reading however we also believe that our students are completely capable of being successful in this class as freshmen it's a great challenging introductory class especially entering into high school and the advanced placement courses that we offer here at south aiken so if you're unsure about whether or not you should take AP Human Geography, I want to encourage all of you to think about talking to your social studies teacher. Your current social studies teacher will truly know your academic abilities and they can make a recommendation for you on whether or not you should take World Geography CP or challenge yourself by taking our AP Human Geography. So once you make that decision, I encourage you to select it, hit the OK button, and it will immediately go up there in your course requests. Then you move on down to ninth grade PE or junior ROTC. And I understand that some of you are already in ROTC one this year. And I wanna say thank you and congratulations to those of you that are taking this course as eighth graders. If you wanna continue on in ROTC, then I wanna make sure that you select ROTC two or you can choose PE, one or the other. You only need to select one of these. It is a requirement in order to graduate from high school. So regardless of your future plans, um, if you plan on, for instance, taking PE over the summer, which a lot of eighth graders do, if they decide to take it through virtual South Carolina online, even if those are your plans, you must still select APE or ROTC1 class. So this is a requirement for all students to select. You can only make one selection at this time. Once you make your choice, click the OK button 
And now you've already completed two online requests. Next up is foreign language. Now, please understand that foreign language is not a requirement to graduate from high school. It is an elective choice. A foreign language gets confused as being a requirement because it is a necessity if you plan on attending a four year college. So again, foreign language is only required if you plan on attending a four year institution. So, but it also is not something that you have to take your freshman year. You can choose to delay it till sophomore year or even junior year if you'd like. It's completely up to you. Obviously, if you decide to take it, click on the pencil. We have offerings in Spanish, German, and French. Make sure that you choose your selection. One for right now. I'm going to click the OK button and move on. And so far I have three. Understand that in these elective choices, you have the opportunity to, to pick four. You have four choices, four openings, and two of those have to come from social studies or PE. So there's my first two. I'm choosing an, a foreign language. So that makes three. So I have one more opening. So moving down to computer science. Computer science is a requirement to graduate from high school. And if you have not taken it in middle school, then you must take it as a freshman in high school. And your choices are between fundamentals of computing or AP computer science principles. Remember that AP in front of any course title means that it is an advanced placement course sponsored by the College Board which are the creators of the SAT, which I'm sure that some of you are familiar with. AP means that it is a college level course. I encourage AP Computer Science for those of you that um, do enjoy computers, do enjoy coding. Um, it has some math in there, um, but you definitely need to be passionate about computers and coding. Otherwise, I'm gonna make the suggestion that you sign up for Fundamentals of Computing. Now, let's say that you've already taken this requirement while in middle school. Anything you can hit cancel. And you don't have to select anything. So, but I still need my fourth elective class. So moving on down, let's look at the fine arts options. Fine art options here at South they can include art, band one, chorus one, piano, music, Guitar, Music Appreciation, and Theater One. Those are your choices for fine arts. So let's just say that I'm into some band. I'm definitely going to sign up for band because I like to play a musical instrument. Or I'm already in band at the middle school. I want to encourage you to continue with that tradition and bring it on over here to South Aiken. All right, make your selection and click OK. I'm not going to necessarily cl click anything there because I want to move on and show you the other elective choices because again you have to have four so ninth grade electives if I don't need a computer science if I don't need a fine arts or maybe I have not selected um, let's just say I'm not going to select a foreign language for my freshman year I'm going to wait and hold off and do that later then I want to look at the elective ch elective choices I have AP Environmental Science, which again, AP, what's that stand for? Advanced Placement. I can also choose Culinary Arts, which is our cooking class. Please be prepared that it is not all about cooking in Culinary Arts 1. In fact, the entire first semester is pretty much book work and safety. So there's a lot of safety things you have to learn in while cooking in a kitchen. Obviously, we have to make sure that you're prepared to do that. So please understand that culinary one is not just all cooking. You will not get to that until second semester. There's also an additional $50 fee if you decide to do culinary arts one. So please make sure your parents are on board with that additional fee. Obviously, it costs some money to buy some groceries. Um, there's some expense to the class. so we have to add in that additional $50. Entrepreneurship, which is about owning your own business. 
or you can take freshman success, which I highly recommend. Freshman success is for students who just feel like they need a little bit of assistance getting ready for the transition into high school. Maybe it's about time management. Maybe it's about organization. Maybe it's just about understanding what credits mean or GPAs. Um, all of that stuff, we have a great um, freshman academy teacher who helps transition our students over to the high school. So maybe freshman success is your up right up your alley and you might want to select. That. Or we also have our famous marketing class where students who think that they want to go into something related to business or entrepreneurship, um, they want to know how things get sold. Um, this marketing is about you know, TV commercials or magazine ads or billboards. It really teaches you about economics, um, but it's a great fun class that a lot of our students enjoy. So I personally am a huge fan of freshman success, so I'm going to register for that one. Now, if you go back here before moving on, I need four elective choices and right now I only have three. I'm going to go back and pick that French one to make sure. Yes, that's what I want. Click OK. Now, moving on to ninth grade alternatives. Alternatives mean that if we cannot get you into your first choice of class, for instance, if South Aiken cannot fit French one or freshman success into your schedule, then counselors have to know what alternative you would like to be in. So if we cannot fit you into French one or freshman success or entrepreneurship or one of the other elective courses that you've previously selected, I'm going to put you into one of these choices. So here we have a whole listing. It goes back to everything. Maybe now as an alternate i want to go ahead and definitely select culinary arts because i am interested in cooking and i definitely think i might want to do art one even so i have to pick three courses here it says you may select three courses you have to select three courses now on this page please be aware that there's two pages i need to go to the next page in order to make sure that i see all of the choices I definitely think about um, if I can't get in the French, then guess what? I want to take Spanish. OK, this is a great place to put an alternative foreign language in the choices. So if I can't get in the French one, I definitely want to try Spanish. Um, I think I have my three choices, Spanish one. Art and culinary arts, great choices. I picked three. I'm going to click OK and now I'm moving on. At the very bottom of this, there will be a submit button. You will see it down here. Please make sure you hit the submit button. Once you hit submit, you will actually get an error message. I know this is hard to believe, but you will actually get an error message and that means you've done it right. Congratulations. You have submitted your ninth grade course requests. Once that's all done, make sure you log out, sign out of the system and I wish you the best of luck and look forward to having you here at South Aiken High School.